guys welcome back to my channel how you guys doing well I'm Afton so in today's video I'll be showing you guys how to make chicken wine pizza I did this video since in March man when was my son birthday but I'm gonna finally upload it for you guys today sorry for the delay so I'll show you guys step by step how to make this chicken Hawaiian pizza and I hope you guys enjoy watching the video. Give my video a thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up the video, okay guys? And also, please subscribe to my channel. And guys, make sure that you click the bell so you guys will be notified whenever I upload a video, all right? I upload video two to three times a week for you guys, okay? And you guys will follow me on Instagram and on Facebook, also at Cooking with Afton. And all my measurements and ingredients will also be in the description box down below and also if you guys would like to support or donate to my channel i will leave that link in the description box down below as well okay guys so let me just show you my ingredients for my chicken and pine pizza or chicken and wine pizza whatever you want to call it so enjoy hey guys so tonight recipe is going to be chicken hawaiian pizza so we have some flour over here flour over here we have our cheese pine yeast we have some cut up chicken thighs we have salt sugar lukewarm water chicken seasoning mustard hot sauce we have our pizza sauce we have some oil and to season up our chicken we have some onion powder garlic powder black pepper and ginger powder so let's get started to make our dough so the first thing I'm going to do, this is my lukewarm water here. I'm going to put in my salt. Stir it a little bit. And then I'm going to put in my yeast. Alright? So you're going to let, let it leave there to bloom for about 10 minutes. So while we're going to wait till my yeast is bloomed, we're going to season up our chicken thighs. So like I said before, in this container here, we have some onion powder, garlic powder, ginger powder, and black pepper. So you're gonna pour all of it into the chicken thighs. Also, you're gonna put some chicken seasoning. And also you're gonna put some mustard hot sauce. And then you're gonna stir it up and make sure all your season come back in we'll be back okay so we're gonna fry up our chicken ties cut up now so I just put some oil into my pan there so you're gonna put in your chicken now to fry it Fry it up until it's finished cooking. Alright? Very simple. Okay, guys, my chicken has been frying up for about 10 minutes, so it's all done here. I'm gonna take off our dough. So, the next step I'm gonna do is make my dough. So, we'll be back. Okay, guys, so we're gonna make our dough now. So, what are you gonna do? This is my yeast hair. I'm going to pour it into the bowl with my flour. I'm going to put in my sugar and my oil. And then I'm going to mix everything together and form a dough. So I'm going to use my hands now and we're going to mix in everything and you're going to need this, alright? So I'm going to mix this for about 10 minutes or so or until it gets smooth, okay? So we'll be back in 10 minutes. So this has been five minutes so far, so I'm going to keep kneading it until it gets smooth. Please forgive my table. My table is keeping 
noise it's shaking <laughs> so we'll be back in five minutes so my dough is finished kneading i need it for 10 minutes so we're gonna do we're gonna put some oil into your pan and rub it make sure the bottom full of oil and also you're gonna put some oil on the top all right coat it with oil all over so now you're gonna cover it so you're gonna take cling wrap here a plastic wrap and you're going to cover it and let it rise for about half an hour to 45 minutes all right so we'll be back when it get double in size okay guys so my pizza dough is double in size so here it is here punch it down i'm only going to be using half of it i use the other half tomorrow to make another pizza all right just gonna use half only so on the pizza pan here i'm also gonna dust some flour in it just gonna dust the flour all over and then i'm gonna spread out my dough and spread it out until you reach at the end of the pan okay so we'll be back so i finished spreading out my pizza dough so we're gonna do take a fork and just gonna press holes all over just like this You're gonna pour in your pizza sauce, All right? You can take a spoon and just gonna circle it around, All right? I'm gonna pour a little bit more. I like a lot of sauce in my pizza. I'm just gonna spread it. Over just like this, perfect. So now we're gonna do. You're gonna get your so now you're gonna put in your cheese on your pizza. You're going to put your cheese all over, just like this. Just like this. So when you finish putting your cheese now, Gonna put in your pineapple. I'm just gonna spread it all over. All over, you're gonna put your pineapple. All right. So you're gonna do it now. You're gonna put your chicken that I cooked earlier. Over the pizza, all over. You're gonna put the chicken, just like this. Perfect. And you're gonna put it in the oven to bake for about 15 to 18 minutes. 
All right, so we'll be back. Okay, guys, my pizza is out of the oven. Here you go. So, I'm gonna cut it and eat it now. Woohoo! I don't even know where my um my pizza cutter is right now, so I have to use a knife. So we'll be back. Okay, guys, so this is my pizza here. I'm going to taste it. Mm. Mm. Oh, my God, it's so hot. <laughs> mm. Tastes really good. So I hope you guys enjoy watching my video. So I hope you guys enjoy watching my video. Give my video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and click the bell so you guys will be notified whenever I upload another video. And you guys can follow me on Instagram, Cooking with Afton, and follow me on Facebook, Cooking with Afton. Okay, take care guys and be safe. Bye.